Hey everyone, Adam here, and today I'm heading off to the Astro to watch one of my favourite movies on the screen there, Ghostbusters, so we got to get going. There it is, the iconic Astro in Melbourne. And here's the interior, uh, it's very old school. And up we go to the cinema there. Before the movie started, they projected the Ghostbusters logo on the cinema curds, which I thought was a nice touch. Okay, so that was my trip to the Astor to see Ghostbusters. Um, as some of you know, it's one of my favourite movies. Uh, but it was great centered on um, the big screen at the Astor. It's an iconic cinema here in Melbourne. But but here's what I like about the original. All the characters, all the main characters are well defined. Like Raise the Heart of the Ghostbusters and the basically the over enthusiastic um, scientist. Egon Sirius. Uh, Beckman, you know, bit of a smart mouth, uh, bit of a flirt, and of course Winston, the uh, everyman who he comes off the street and starts working with them. But you know, there's so many good characters. Of course, after forty years, some special effects don't look as good, but some still hold up. A lot of the practical effects still hold up. And, you know, this is one movie I've pretty much watched um, so many times since, well, technically since I got on VHS. Uh, but, you know, it's such a great movie. Well directed. The cast chemistry is also what makes it. They all work so well together. Which might have been missing from the other one that came out in 2016. Yeah, so, I mean, most people have seen it, so I don't have to really talk about the plot, but it was just so good seeing it on the big screen at the at the Asta. So let us know what did you think of Ghostbusters. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. I'm Adam, and I'll see you again soon.